And could this affect other projects? Well, I think there will be fallout politically, and perhaps this does strengthen the hand of the mayor who wants to take over some commuter services. But opponents of other projects that are being run by the DFT, like HS2, the high-speed uh, rail link uh, up to the north, they now want the business case looked at. They've got concerns about that, particularly some concerns from Tory MPs. The Secretary of State has found something fundamentally wrong at the heart of the Department of Transport that deals with railways. Uh, some of the flaws are obviously around the West Coast Main Line. That has great implications for the business case and the way in which HS2 is being put forward. We need to get to the heart of this. HS2 needs to be halted. We need an integrated transport policy. The big question is who's going to pay for this? Some £40 million. Pounds. I'm afraid that's going to be the taxpayer or the fare payer. Tom, thank you. Our transport correspondent, Tom Edwards.